Hi, this is Melinda Webb Huggin with Dreams and Destinations, and I'm back again with Courtney, our BDM with Sandals and Beaches Resorts, and we are so excited to talk today about Sandals Barbados and Sandals Royal Barbados. Um, we love these resorts. I just had my whole team here in January to get to know the destination and to get to know these resorts, and really, I didn't think anything could replace Sandals South Coast in my heart as my favorite, but these resorts are giving Sandals South Coast a run for its money. Um, they were fabulous, so we wanted to present them today for you. And then if you have any questions following this video, please feel free to reach out to us. Um, we've been to the resort. I've been there multiple times to Sandals Barbados and Sandals Royal Barbados. Um, we know the room categories. We can definitely you know, help you figure out how to book your vacation there. And then if you have any questions about all the amazing things that set Sandals apart from other all-inclusive properties, be sure to check out our video on the Sandals difference. The link to that video is in the comments below. So, okay, Courtney, let's go ahead and show them more about these amazing resorts. Yes, and I have to say you took the words out of my mouth. South Coast is, will always be my personal favorite, has a special place in my heart, but Sandals Barbados is right there underneath it. Like you said, I didn't think it was possible to replace it, but Sandals Royal Barbados and Barbados come as close as you can get. All right, so looking at Sandals Barbados, we actually have two resorts here. We have Sandals Royal Barbados and Sandals Barbados. And one of the greatest things about this destination is our exchange privileges. Um, we actually have exchange privileges between these two resorts, and unlike some of our other destinations, they don't require transfer service. They're right next to each other, where almost you can't even tell which one you're on. You're basically getting two massive resorts in one. Um, so between the two, you have five pools, four whirlpools, 18 different restaurants, and 12 different bars for you to enjoy. So Sandals Barbados was the original one here. Um, one of my personal favorites about this uh, resort is how accentuated nature is here. Um, the big focus with Sandals is if we're building a new resort, we're not just wiping the slate clean and destroying everything that's there. We really want to work around the gorgeous nature and make you feel like you're really jumping into a Caribbean destination. So I absolutely love it for that reason. These are some of the suites that we offer here at Sandals Barbados. As I mentioned again, if you're staying at either of these, you have complete free range of both resorts, so you almost can't tell which one you're staying on. Here at Sandals Barbados, we do have a Bombay Club, which is our Indian cuisine. I definitely uh, recommend you try the butter chicken. I've heard it's absolutely amazing. I haven't tried it personally. That's what everyone always talks about. Um, and then, of course, our Butch's Chop House. So our Butch's Chop House, for those of you who don't know, is your high-end steakhouse, um, very similar to like your Ruth Chris and your Morton's, but it's all included. Um, so if you want to order one of everything on the menu, you can do that. Those same kind of quali high quality uh, cuts of beef you get here at Butch's Chop House. Sandals Royal Barbados is the newest resort in the brand. It was actually just completed in 2017. The style of this resort is very chic, very contemporary. So if you're interested in that really modern, really sleek look, I would definitely recommend this one for you. It's very chic, it's very, very high end feeling, like I said, very modern and contemporary in its style. Um, pictured here on the right is actually the Caribbean's largest infinity edge pool. It is absolutely amazing. Um, though I will say this picture does not do it justice. Um, it's really funny if you're ever walking by and you see couples swimming in it. It makes your body look a little distorted, so it's not the best place for pictures, but it can kind of be a fun photo op because you have the tiny little heads and the big bodies. And these are some of our, we have our sky pool suites as well as our swim up suites here at Sandals Royal Barbados. We also have some new innovations here that cannot be found at any other Sandals resort. Um, number one is our Lover's Lane Bowling Alley. So this is our four lane bowling alley. Um, I think a lot of people hear that and they think, oh man, it must be really busy, but that's actually one of my favorite things about Sandals and I'm sure Melinda can attest to it. Even when it's at its fullest, it never feels crowded. You're never fighting for a spot to get anywhere, and that includes the bowling alley here. You just walk up, uh, give them your shoe size, and you get to bowling. It's also connected to our international bar. So that bar carries 18 different international beers where you can literally drink around the world, and the bar is actually lined with a frost rail. So it's lined with a rail of ice that you can sit your beer on to keep it cold. Um, I remember when they told me that, I didn't really get why that was a, a big thing. And I told my dad, who's a big beer drinker, and he absolutely lost his mind. So that reassured to me that beer drinkers definitely want your cold beer, no warm beer. It's a really great innovation that we have here that, again, you cannot find anywhere else. 
Um, here we also have our rooftop bar and re restaurant, La Parisienne. As you see, you have incredible views. Um, the rooftop bar is a little bit behind you. You see that kind of round pavilion that sticks out, as well as our game area here on the left outside of our Lover's Lane bowling alley where you can sit, drink, congregate, um, watch a game. You can play board games, play video games, things like that. Just a ton of really new innovations that we have here at Sandals World Barbados. Barbados is also an absolutely gorgeous island. If you get there, definitely take some time to go off and enjoy some of the excursions that it has to offer. Um, but you will definitely find something for everyone here at Sandals Barbados and Sandals Rural Barbados. So, Courtney, I have to ask you, what was your favorite experience in January when we were there? I have to say that mine was all of the smack talking with our team at the Lovers <laughs> Bowling Alley. Like, that was so much fun. And even the shoe guys were getting in on it. It was just like this ongoing competition all night between the staff and our team. I have to say that was probably mine as well. It started off very innocent and like, oh, we're just going to play a fun game of, of bowling. But it gets intense and everyone got into it. Like you said, even the staff. That's one of my favorite things about Sandals too, though, is that the staff gets so involved and they become a, such a fun part of your trip too because like you said, they were in there talking smack just like the rest of us. And I will say my bowling game was not very strong. But next time we go, I'm practicing, I'm getting ready, and I'm going to be better, I promise. We found, though, that the international bar with all the beers helps you not care. If your bowling game That's is true. <laughs> so. That's true. The alcohol definitely helped. The more we started to drink, I think the less competitive it got because no one just, everyone started filtering off into the bar where everyone forgot they were bowling. Right. But yeah, that was definitely probably the highlight. Uh, my second highlight, though, would definitely probably be Butch's Steak and Seafood Restaurant because that meal was absolutely, so absolutely the best for us. That meal is actually on par with many of the high-end steakhouses that I've enjoyed here in the U.S. And my husband and I had actually just a few months before gone to um, a high-end steakhouse for our anniversary dinner. And that meal was $300. The meal that we had that night at Butch's Chop House was definitely on par with that. And so you can just imagine the savings that if you start calculating every aspect of a sandals vacation and the quality that goes into it, it's a huge savings for the price that you pay. But yeah, the bowling was my favorite. Afternoons in the pool, we had a an agency meeting every afternoon in the pool, and that was a lot of fun too. And then that beach is just gorgeous. It's one of the yeah. best. Beaches. So, well, thank you for joining us this morning, and we just appreciate you taking your time to find out a little bit more about resorts that we love. Courtney, thanks so much for presenting this with me, and we'll catch you in our next video. Awesome. Thank you so much.